Hey everyone, uh, doing hard reset as promised. Uh, right when it, right, it just came out right now, so uh, you know I'm finally in the game. Uh, I'll just show this off again because of the the whole demo uh, situation here. The menu I thought was really really impressive. Like it's just really kind of like you know uh, highly animated. So much effort being put into it. But if you recall, my one complaint I think it was everyone's complaint was that it was really slow. But they added this little checkbox at the bottom. This is awesome. They must have done this based upon the feedback. Check it out. How, look how fast it is now. Now it's like pretty normal. That's awesome. <laughs> it's still it's still fairly impressive. Uh, regardless of that, it's just a lot faster now. It probably should have been, it probably should be checked by default. But you know what? They added the option, so no complaints here. Uh, so without further ado, let's uh, start a new game. Uh, oh, X mode. Oh. Okay. Well, um, I said that insane would probably result in me going back too much uh, and being stuck on parts. So I would actually prefer to do if it, since, this is, uh, since this is my blind run. Uh, I'm going to do it on hard, and then insane, probably I'll do another run on my own after X mode, I have no idea what that is. But yeah, okay, let's, let's go. January 17, 2436, Sector 6, European District, Bazaar City. Have someone join me after the shift is over. I don't like to drink alone. Most of the days are like this. I'm a proud soldier of the corporation. Others like me are made by the PR department to be sentinels of the sanctuary, the defenders of Bazaar. Amusingly, I do it for the money. We defend the sanctuary, a network that holds billions of digitalized personalities of human beings. The machines are our enemy. The corporation's eggheads proposed a theory implying the existence of an unsurpassable evolutionary limit of the current AI. The sanctuary is the possibility of the machines to break this limit. Hey guys, uh, so uh, here we start again. It looks like it's the exact same demo level uh, once again. I've already played it several times. I guess I'll give you my feedback that I gave before uh, in the demo if you haven't watched it. Basically, I thought the Max Payne style comic intros were really, really cool. It's like the best part to me. Come on, I'm right in there. Oh, there we go. Whoa. Uh, basically, I'm already familiar with most of this, so I don't really have to worry. Although, I'm going to be checking most of these areas just to make sure that I didn't, uh, there isn't more here. There we go. Uh, naughty. Okay. Hey, look, my achievement. Got unlocked. Oh, whoops. It's also instructing you about secret areas as well, which is kind of interesting. Uh... But I, I'm guessing you won't do that every single time. But you know, secrets are secrets. Alrighty. Well basically, uh, the, the basics of the game is you actually have two weapons with two different ammo supplies. The ammo does regenerate a little bit. Uh, there's no melee attack as far as I can tell. Uh, you, and it does regenerate when you get low, so I guess that's how they prevent you from having a, a situation where you have no ammo and can't do anything. Um, but this one's uh, more like 
pew pew-ish kind of gun. This one's more of a machine gun-ish kind of gun. Uh, that's the best way I can describe it, but they all have, they each have five different firing modes. Which makes it kind of interesting. That's a, li that's a lot of variation. I, I think that, that solves the problem of, you know, t having too much ammo supplies to worry about. Oh, whoops. I forgot about you. Sorry, my good man. I'll go grab this health as well. You do have regenerating health to the extent that your uh, armor regenerates, but not your actual health. Uh, and health doesn't always mean that... Whoa. Oh, there he is. So dead. And... Regenerating health doesn't... Oh, uh, it doesn't mean you won't take damage from health when you have full shields. You will. And here's our first first mini-boss. I'm just kind of taking cover behind these things. Hey, look, there's a thing I probably never got the last time. But, or maybe it wasn't. it just wasn't there. See, a lot of these things look an awful lot like there'd be something in them. But I guess not. Oh, that's a lot of health. Plus 80 health, damn. Glad I'm, I'm glad I'm doing it hard on my first run. Alright, uh... Yeah, and I know there's something behind that wall. Whoa! Oh, the cars blow up, that's right. I don't really want to take that health while I'm taking it anyway, so... Alright. There is something behind this wall, but I don't quite know how I'm supposed to actually hit it. Short of getting the grenade launcher upgrade really early on. Uh, I, which I guess I could do. Because, um, well, what, what... Oh, wait, wait. Oh, there we go. Well, that solves that. Okay, I was wondering. I, I knew there had to be some kind of solution. Oh. Uh, this is the energy gun. Uh, okay, let's go. It's it's more of an old school kind of shooter. It's kind of actually quite nice. Uh, we'll turn that off. And it looks like that weapon thing that was uh, in the demo isn't here anymore. Because I guess they want you to, to figure it out. Okay. Well, I know cars blow up. So... There we go. And it's a bit of uh, old school puzzle tracking. You know, you get rewards for for this kind of shit. I love this stuff. It's so good. The style's fantastic. I think I'm in for a real treat, but you know, we're just starting off now. Relatively cheap game. Go get it on Steam. Uh, I highly recommend it. All right. Uh, I've disabled the energy barrier. Oh shit. Oh, something's hitting me a whole lot. You know, I hate these little minions. I hate this guy too. Huge pain in the ass to deal with. I should probably be using machine gun. But you know, I, I like I I realize that the best way is to make them path around pillars and stuff. Because they ha they seem to have a lot of trouble doing that. Stupid robots. There we go, I got a new upgrade. My first new upgrade. Uh, I think we're good here. As far as I can tell, those, those ammo things that he drops uh, completely, uh, like, turns off. Uh, sorry, not turns off. Turn off anything. I didn't do it. Uh, it completely regenerates all your health, which is kind of nice. There we go. Oh. You gotta watch out for these secondary explosions. But we're getting a lot of nice ammo. Uh, oh, well, might as well open that. Well, there's another Kraken wall here. No. Ah, here we go. Uh, I'm not gonna use this quite as of yet, although I will blow that up. Okay, nothing there. Alright, let me just double check over here. You won grand prize. 
Look at this offer. Wow. Have you ever considered becoming immortal? No, I have not. It's nice to see in the future advertising hasn't really gotten much better. Anyways, here, we'll just grab this crap. Alright, and we'll keep moving up then. Uh, I have a special offer right now. <laughs> Don't you want to restock? I do want to restock. Yeah, we gotta look in every little crevice for, for items, which is really nice. Anyways, we come to our first little puzzle here, which is basically we have to destroy it, it, the power supply here. And you do that by going to the other side. Very, very simple. Uh, is there anything back here? Nah. Oh, wait, right here. There we go. I'm hoping to get two up and upgrades by the time we go, go into the next area, but, you know, it may not happen. Revenge? How'd I get, re how'd I get revenge? There we go. Oh, fuck you. You don't bring your saw chainsaw around. Alright, well, there's a thing over here, so we're gonna go get that. Every little bit counts. I noticed that I gained a lot more in the demo post to what I have right now. But I guess that makes sense, you know, you, you're progressing more at a realistic rate. I didn't, I didn't actually expect it to remain that way. Anyways, let's go back up here and there's the solution to the puzzle. I said, I, this is blind, but this is the demo that I played previously, so... And here we go. Let's see, can we actually get the railgun off the bat? It's all more upgrades. Yeah, so it doesn't want you to get the railgun off the bat. I assume so. Let's see what it says about this one. Okay. Before these were not available in the demo. Now it just wants more upgrades, so... Uh, we're gonna get the one I liked before. This one I really liked. I had a thing for this one. Yeah, it's gonna be a while before I can do that. Damn it, I want the railgun so bad. This would be kind of retarded if you could just start with it. So I I, I read somewhere that they were they made it more obvious that you switched we uh, weapons or something. I'm not really getting that drift from this. All right, I think it would be possible if you had two. I probably missed one thing because look how close I am to getting a new tech upgrade. I must have missed just one thing. But I don't need it. I'm good. Don't worry, guys. Oh, and you guys know what this means. Final boss. No, not really. Alright. There we go. Oh, wow. <laughs> like three achievements at once. I bad badass. At video games. There we go. I heard a lot of complaints about the uh, qu the checkpoints it gives you as well, which uh, could be completely legitimate. I don't really know at this point. There we go. Use the environment to your advantage, kids. Alright. Put that thing go. Alright. And we're going to just run over here. There we go, we got him. Uh-oh. And this is not over. Yep, it's not. Boy, am I glad I decided... Okay, let's play this on hard instead of insanity. Although this is technically technically the exact same thing. There we go. That's what, there's one. Really, using the environment is exactly what like you know what makes this so much easier. All right. Uh, oh, this is a problem. How am I supposed to get to this? Oh, here we go. And now we got all our ammo back. Alright, we can get another upgrade. I don't know if more upgrades refers to getting more upgrades in this thing. Uh, 
electric mine is status grenade area effect increased. You can also get a secondary. I wouldn't mind getting uh, some of these uh, upgrades like this. This one's not too bad. Uh, that bad. Uh, static. This is actually a nice ability as well, so I would like to fully invest in this. I'm first going to get that one now. Let's actually tell us. Wait, I want to see what the message actually says now. Ah, uh, more upgrades. Damn you, game. Damn you from denying me from what the we from the weapon I want so much. Uh, property damage. Well, this is about where the demo stopped, so this is about where it starts becoming... Whoa. Uh, more blind than before. Well, you know, I, I, I have no idea where to go anymore. Just mess dicking around. And also grabbing these things. You know, when you when when you blow stuff, when you blow shit up, more shit happens. That's probably a piece of advice you can use in every in daily life. Oh, okay, I see. Ah, uh, I wish I could save this. I'll just turn this off. Maybe it's some achievement for turning things off. Yeah, go right into there. Yep. Yep, you idiots. <laughs> I love how the car alarms go off. It's such a nice touch. Huh. I really love this world, like the, the futuristic blimps. Every game needs futuristic blimps. Yeah. Oh crap. Oh, no upgrade available already. Well, I can wait until the next one. Oh damn it, I blew those all up with the chain reaction. Would have liked to save those. Or maybe not, maybe I've been there already. Oh, here we go, we go where the robots came from. Obviously, a fantastic idea. Oh shit, one health. Okay. I would have really sucked if I died at the end. Oh, 99%. Nice. I like these stats. Alright, let's continue. Is feeding our system with false data. Or someone. The culprit may still be in Sector 6. Have the CLN track the source of the signal. Nerd is my middle. You could have shown your soldiering while on patrol, Major. The patrol during which the machines breached the barrier. Name. My first is yes, sir. HQ. The media just announced the number of casualties in Sector 6. 760 dead. I would call it a medical miracle. Our PR department? Resurrected about a thousand souls. A few blocks away, in one of the alleyways near the viewing tower, you will find a generator. Plant the first tracking device there. Yeah, the area of effect is certainly upgraded. Alright, uh, I guess what we'll do is, uh, I guess we'll go into this. Because I, now it's, it's fully upgraded. Or, wait. Do I not have, no, I have one. Why is it not working? There we go. Oh, can we get it now? Nope. I'm going to check every freaking time, because it would tell me not enough nano. Yeah, I know. Are these explosive? I guess not. Nope, they're not. Come to Papa. Oh, here we go. Hey, 
I can just get them while they're in there. The inside. Oh, the time bubble is huge. I just noticed that. That thing's awesome. If you don't like the time bubble ability, you're, you're just crazy. It costs a lot of uh, energy, though. But it's great when you're in a tight spot. Oh. Oh, jeez. Use a bit of this. Maybe I need to increase the rate of fire of this gun, because I, I use the machine gun a lot. Uh, not, nothing this thing uses. There we go. Oh, wow. And I just caught on fire. That sucks. I didn't even realize I could catch on fire. Alright. Yeah, it kind of sucks I can't quick save. I'd probably make this whole thing a lot simpler. But, you know, I, then again, I, I'm tempted to abuse it all the time. That's probably why they don't even allow you to do it. Oh, jeez. What could that be? There we go. Bad boy. Whoa. Oh, that hurts a lot. Oh, that hurts even more. Jesus Christ. Okay, I didn't know they were flanking me. <laughs> I guess it helps to be aware. And this is why I didn't do Insanity. I'm already off to a wonderful start. Uh, there we go. I think I think I was supposed to have a tracking thing. Uh, wonder what key that was. Do I even get it by uh, by default? I wonder. Yes, I do. It's a directional. I don't. I don't. Oh, there we go. I don't need. I don't know what key I did to activate it, but I don't even know if I actually need it. So let me just turn it off. I just want to know what the key is, so I can dick around with that whenever I want. Oh, it's E? No, R. Okay, R. Let's say reload I do that, okay. Uh, did I actually do it? I don't think I actually got the upgrade. For some reason. Oh, what, why would... I, I should just check the, uh, see if I actually used an ability. That's an easy way of determining that. Come get me. Yeah, the, the energy thing is much more effective when there's swarming like this. Alright, well, I think the number one thing we've learned already in this game that don't let them surround you. If they surround you, you're dead. Uh, well, at least on this difficulty. I think the other ones don't apply as, as much. And uh, get a nice splash damage going. Watch your back. Oh, there we go. That's what did it. So all we have to do is go this way. That obviously makes this now impassable. And that probably also blew me up. Oh, there we go. I think I was their flanking gentleman guy. There we go. That's what did it. Okay, we learned something new. The, okay, it did eventually go out. Oh, whoa. Okay. I just noticed how the... Peop one of the complaints was that the thing had a very long cooldown. Uh, between switching weapons, th that's only because when you fire something like the rail gun, or the, for example, this gun has a very high cooldown, you have to wait for the cooldown to end, uh, which is actually pretty reasonable. Um, 
Uh, this is mostly from a multiplayer perspective, uh, but I guess I guess they decided it was worthy of a single player as well, because this is a single player game. Uh, if you guys didn't know, there's no multi, uh, so all the mechanics are probably designed from the ground up. In, in my in mind of. Uh, Okay, this opens up. Well, I guess I can just go grab it. Oh, that's rather nice. Do I get to do anything? Nope. Oh yes, and the and the interface. That's right. It reminds me a lot of Doom Three. I well, that was one of actually the cool things about Doom Three. Everyone, everyone didn't like Doom Three. I actually liked. I, well, I didn't like like it, but I thought it wasn't as bad as people thought it was. I just have my own opinion about things. Pretty much the same, like, you know, people think Dead Island's a piece of shit, but I think I... I think it's actually okay, it's pretty fun. It's not the worst port I've ever seen. Three IPU exams. But yet there's games like Borderlands, which I just... I hate to death almost. But yet I'm playing that recently, so... You know. What do I know? Perspective. So I, I wonder if anyone like commented in the last video and was like, "You missed one percent of the fucking nano upgrades." Oh dear God! I know. I just re I just recently did Deus Ex and I, I got so much shit for missing stuff there. So. Oh hi. Oh crap! That was not. Actual real cover. That's not real co What cover is real here? There we go. And I do like how the time bubble doesn't affect me. That's obviously advantageous. Alright, uh, I guess there's nothing else here for me. I wonder what's in this room. Well, that looks like somewhere I could possibly be. But I don't see a way to get in, so it's... Maybe... You never know. Could be just atmosphere. Uh, not atmosphere. I can help you. Yeah, I'm sure you can. Ah, uh, it's just... I don't think... Yeah, I have no more upgrade points, so... Oh, well, actually... Did I, did I check to see if I get the railgun yet? Install more upgrades. Does it refer to that? Weapon upgrade. Passive velocity and frequency increased. Alright, well I'm, I'm gonna start working on this gun actually. I don't really want to do the shotgun. I never found the shotgun to be that incredibly useful. Um, I'll see what I want to go into. I, I didn't actually want to get all the weapon upgrades, but I'm not sure if it's insisting that I get all of them. Oh, cool. Dude, that looks like like a ship out of the Matrix, almost. Just a couple, like, little... doohickeys. Wow. I, I really want to know what these are and why I'm getting so many. Oh, you dumb bots. Uh... Uses obstacle. Oh, so I guess you know, no, cr no crouching for this sucker. Come get me! Let's get out of here! Oh shit! It's always nice to freeze them like this. Uh, uh oh. Okay, here we go. I got one. Oh, I thought that, that guy was done for. That's what you have to use the running for. You know, I really need my, my, my shields to come back. No regenerating health! Oh 
Oh, jeez. Oh, Christ. Oh, man. Oh, oh, crap. Uh, I need a place that can run to. I guess I can just go right back here. I mean, this worked last time. Okay. I was sort of hoping that would be, uh... Something I could blow up. But, you know, this works too. Wow, this the key is, to this game is so much environmental damage. It's a good thing I invested in that, uh... The water gun really, really soon. Uh, I don't know how the railgun fares though, but I, I'm probably sure I'm gonna have like ten orgasms when I get it. Be fit. Work better. Uh. All right, I got another point. All right, let's go upgrade this thing for a change. All right, let's go this way. Get him around this corner. I love this thing because it, it's like it just they walk into it and it, and you know causes them problems. Yes, I know. You're you're parked in the middle of the friggin' road. What do you want me to do? I oh I could have sworn there was actually a weapons upgrade station here. I thought there was. I'm guessing I'm thinking of another area and I forgot already. Uh, well, well let's just see what's over here. I didn't quite finish up here. I think I did actually finish up. Well, you know, I can get, grab that health now. So yeah, there's there, there's absolutely no uh, quick saving. Okay, well, there's another thing down there. Let's go over here for a brief, wait, brief second. Follow the... Oh, yeah. Okay. I assumed it would be... Well, I gotta go up there somewhere. So we got some close quarters. Crap. Maybe so. Alright. Well, if I still can't get my f famed railgun, then... You know, I don't know if I just need to get that, and then that will unlock. Um, I'm gonna... You know I'm gonna do? I'm gonna try to invest into this a little bit. The magnifying scope is completely pointless. Rate of fire, though, I like. I don't really like the grenade launcher or the combat shotgun, though, so... What's this one, though? Uh, cluster missile. Oh yeah, the rocket launcher. I was gonna get that too at some point. Okay, let's try this one because I really like the machine gun. Alright. I'm gonna assume that I have to get uh, the next upgrade, and so I'm gonna just invest into it anyways. That's kind of neat. Like hologram. Okay, I have to like run through it. Oh crap. Stop blowing up. Well, that's a simple solution. There's a lot of guys here. I don't actually need oh you know what? I, I might as well pick this up anyway. The generator was powered off in order to breach the city's barriers. Plant the first tracking device here. Not a tracking device, it's a... It it's a virus or something. I downloaded it. The processing power of the factory mainframe has been used to breach the city's defenses. Get to the main terminal and plot another tracking device. Thank you, lady. Uh... Get to the factory... This was a secret? Oh, I guess so. I wouldn't have thought it was. Oh, you piece of shit. How fast is this fire now? Oh, I do notice a bit of an improvement. I don't know if the ammo consumption is up. Did he jump somewhere? Oh. Hey, buddy. 
Oh, wow. I'm trying to slow him down. There we go. Oh, fuck, that blew me up. <laughs> okay, I'm going to resume this after. Uh, so, uh, you guys have a good one. And uh, see you later. Hope you're enjoying.